Hello, sports fans, and welcome to our next game in the first round of the Colossus College Football Tournament using Second Season Express. Yesterday, Notre Dame defeated Washington by a score of 31 to 28. You can take a look at that video at the link here. We are in the next game of the first round, which will be the 1984 BYU Cougars and the 1999 Florida State Seminoles. So let's go ahead and go down to the field and get today's action underway. Got our team set up here. Let's go ahead and see who will be receiving the first kickoff, and that will be Brigham Young. So Florida State will be receiving in the start of the second half. Let's go ahead and get this action underway as Florida State kicks off and BYU will start in the second zone. BYU is going to go run for their first set of plays against the Blitz. That'll be 26, at least one player rated run two on the offensive line. And that is a no. Nobody is. So that is little room, no gain, and they will go ahead and punt for four zones. As Florida State gets set to take their, begin their first possession. They are going to go pass. Chris Winkie is the quarterback. Peter Wark, the wide receiver. William McCray the fullback, Travis Miner, their running back. They will go pass against a safe for their first sequence of plays. 24, any player on offensive line rated two pass, and no, nobody is. And that will be a sack. So Florida State in their own territory, they won't move back his own, but they're going to go ahead and punt for their first Possession that'll be a four one two three four zone punt. BYU comes out for their second possession of the first quarter. They will go past this time, seeing if they can have a little more luck. That'll be a safe defense by Florida State. 13 is a passer's completion grade D or better. Robbie Bosco is an A. That is a yes, and that'll be a complete four two zones. BYU getting closer to Florida State territory. They will pass once again against a blitz. 45, offensive penalty kills the drive. Their drive ends. They're going to go ahead and punt for O. One zone, roll again. If one, punt is returned for a touchdown, and it won't be. So good return there by Florida State as they, they begin in their fourth zone. They're going to go run first against a safe. 46, that will be two or more linebackers rated run two. Kurt Gouveia is run two, and Kerry Whittingham is run two, so that is a yes. The runner is decked, and that occurred on third down. So Florida State will be punting once again, as that is an O oh, snap. Ooh, a block. So the punt is going to be blocked. BYU in great field position. Start their next possession. They're going to go run against a blitz. And 63 is a home team on offense. BYU is home for first and third. So, yes, they are. Huge space, huge hole, open space for an XR. That is a go, and that's going to be a touchdown by uh, Fred Whittingham. So BYU scores first. They go for the extra point. Lee Johnson is an A, so he needs an 11 to 64, and he gets it. So BYU, by BYU goes up 7 to nothing here in the first quarter. And they get ready to kick. Florida State will begin in zone 2. Down 7 to nothing already here in the first quarter. They're going to go pass. Whoa. Pass against the pass. So BYU chooses right. 
and 62. Any linebacker rated two pass. And that is going to be Marv Allen. So, yes, and Winky is sacked once again. The O-line is not protecting him as they go ahead and punt, and it's going to go one, two, three zones. BYU looking to bust this thing open early here in the first quarter as they go run against a pass. So Florida State chooses wrong. 44, two or more players rated run two on the defensive line. Roland Seymour is two. Jerry Johnson is two. So that is, yes, penetration by the defense that happened on third down. So they will punt, and it will go three zones. Florida State deep in their territory to start their next possession. They're going to go run this time against a safe. 35, two or more players rated run zero on the offense. And see here, no, Ron Durgens is the only zero. So that is a no. That is going to be a gain. XR of four. One, two, three, four to end the first quarter. So Florida State marching down the field. We go to the second quarter with BYU up seven to nothing. And Florida State will continue this drive as they're going to go for a pass against a safe. 21 is the passer's completion grade AA or better. Winky is only an A, so that is a no. Is his Y greater than 7? No, it's a 4. That will be incomplete. As the drive will stall, they're going to come out for a field goal. Sebastian Janikowski is an AA. Zone 3, he needs a 45, and he gets a 42. So Florida State on the board, it is 7 to 7-3. As they kick off to BYU, BYU will start in zone two for their next possession of the second quarter. They're going to go pass, starting out against a safe. 53, two or more DBs rated two pass. Tay Cody is not. Sean Key is not. Derek Gibson is not. Cleavon Thomas is not. So that's going to be a completion. Robbie Bosco is not a bomber. So it's just going to be a regular completion. Ooh, but that's an XP. Four. That is four zones. One, two, three, four. BYU with a big gain there. Big set of events as they go run for their next possession. Run versus safe. 64. Two or more defensive linemen rated run zero. That is not the case. The wrestler is wrestled down. I don't think there's any question mark, so we shouldn't have to choose. Nope. And that happened on second down, so they get one more chance here as they're going to go uh, pass against the Blitz. 22. It's passers completion grade AA or better. Robbie Bosco is only an A, so that is a no. Is his Y grade greater than 8? Nope. That will be an incomplete to stall the drive. They're going to go for a field goal from zone three. Lee Johnson is an AA. He needs a 45, and he gets it as BYU gets their three points back. It is 10 to 3. As they get ready to kick off to Florida State, 10 minutes left in the second quarter. Florida State will begin in zone two. They're going to come out and pass for their first chain, first set of events. Pass versus safe. 55. Any DB rated two pass. Mark Allen is. That's going to be an interception by uh, Morel, Kyle Morell. So let's see where the interception, where they end up. Four, that is one zone ahead. So a big turn over there by Florida State as BYU looks to go up by two scores here with nine minutes left in the second quarter. They're going to go run for their first chain of events against a run, so Florida State guesses right. 43, four or more players ready to run zero on the offense. Robert Anae is a negative one, so 
that is one. And Mark Bellini is a negative one, so there's two. And that is it. So that is a no. That's going to be a gain of one for BYU. They will take it as they kind of come out and pass against a pass. So Florida State guesses right once again. Sixteen is passer's completion grade A or better. Robbie Bosco is A. That's going to be complete. He needs a two through six, and he gets it. Touchdown, BYU. As Robbie Bosco connects with um, Adam Haysbert for the score, here is the extra point. He needs 11 through 64, and he gets it. BYU goes up 17 to 3 here in the second quarter. BYU piling it on here halfway through the second as Florida State will start in zone three to begin. They need to get something going here. BYU is going to run away with it. Florida State's going to come out and pass against a safe defense. 41, any tight end or wide receiver rated two pass. Peter Wark is. That's going to be a completion of two zones. Florida State marching down the field as they're going to go ahead and pass again against a blitz. Fifty-one. Any player on the defensive line rated zero pass, and that is a no. That is going to be a sack, which is going to take Florida State out of field goal range. Big sack there. If the sack occurs in the enemy territory, they move back one zone. So Florida State down seventeen to three. They are. They're going to go ahead and punt here. That's going to be an 0-1. Oh, so if we roll one again, the punt is going to be returned for a touchdown. It's not, just barely. It's a two, but they only get a one-zone punt out of it. So BYU here with three minutes left in the half. Looking to go up big here as they're going to go pass against a run. So wrong guess by Florida State. That could be... Very bad. 31, any player in the offensive backfield rated two pass. Robbie Bosco is, as well as Glenn Kozlowski. That is going to be a completion. Good chance here for a big gain. There's an XP, a go, five zones. One, two, three, four, five. That is a touchdown by BYU. Bosco connects with Glenn Kozlowski. For another six points, the extra point is good. BYU up 24 to 3 with two minutes left in the half. BYU just steamrolling over Florida State here as Florida State will begin in zone two for the, their next drive of the half. They're going to come out, run, play a little conservative against a pass. 15 is runner B or better. We're going to check who that is. 9 is uh, Travis Miner. Inside, is he B or better? Yes, he is. And we go to an XR chart. So this could be what they need to get things going. They're going to go five or four zones. One, two, three, four. A minute and a half left in the half as Florida State goes past against safe. I think there's been three sacks of Winky so far. This game, Israel 4th, 36. Defensive penalty sustains a drive for one zone. There's one minute left. They're going to go run against the safe. Can they punch one in here? 12 is runner AAA or better. Uh, no, there is not any. So that is a no. He's going to be tripped up. They get one more uh, possession. And down 24 to 3. They're going to go ahead and go for it. Go for a pass here. Against a run. So good call there by Florida State. Not so much by BYU, but a good chance to get some points here. 13 
Is the passer's completion grade D or better? Chris Winkie is an A, so that is a yes. That is a completion. That is a touchdown. Two. Uh, Menace. Where is Menace? Snoop Menace. The extra point is good. Florida State gets back in this. It is 24 to 10 at the half. So a good end of the half drive there for Florida State as they receive the ball to begin the second half. So they go down the field and score here. They're right back in this. BYU kicks off and that will go to zone three for Florida State's first possession of the second half. They are going to go pass right out of the gate. Ooh, BYU calls a pass. They're not getting fooled again. 22. Passers grade AA or better? No, it is not. Is passers Y greater than 6? No. And that will be incomplete as the drive will stall and Florida State will punt as they get a good one off. One, two, three, four zones. BYU 12 minutes left in the third quarter comes out for their first possession of the half. They're going to go run against the pass. A good call there by them. 62. At least one defensive back rated run zero. Uh, that is a no. So that is a no gain. It happened on first or second down. So they get one more shot here as they go pass against the safe. Ooh, that is an 11. Is the passer grade greater than 5? Is the passer's Y grade greater than 5? No. And that is going to be a completion. So the drive will continue on as completion for three zones. BYU with a big pickup there as they're going to go run against a safe. 34. At least one player rated run zero in the offensive background. And that is nobody. They are all at least one. So that is a no. That is a gain of two. BYU marching down the field with nine minutes left here in the third quarter. They're going to go run again against the Blitz. Can they get past the blitz, pick it up, and get past it? 32. Two or more players rated run two on the offense. And that will be a Luke Hamile is a one plus. So that is a yes. Gwen Kozlowski is a no. So that is a no and a loss. And that will stall the drive as they are in zone two. They go for a field goal by Lee Johnson. He's in AA zone two. He needs an 11 to 63. He gets it. BYU with a field goal, seven minutes left in the third quarter, 27 to 10, as they get set to kick off to Florida State here with seven minutes left. Zone or three, that's a zone two, Florida State. Coming back out for their next possession, they're gonna go run against a pass. Fourteen is a runner A or better. We're gonna look see who it is. Fourteen. That is gonna be Nick Maddox inside. No. He is not an A or better. So that's gonna be no gain. But they Florida State gets one more shot here. They're gonna go pass against the safe. Fifty-four. That is a fumble. Oh, that is not what Florida State needed as BYU in great territory. Great field position. Five minutes left in the third quarter. They're going to come out passing against a safe. 66. Three or more defenders rated two pass. And that will be A. Brian Allen is one. Corey Simon is two. And that's going to be a no. So that is a completion. And that is going to be a touchdown. Robbie Bosco hooks up with Lakay Hamuli for the touchdown. Lee Johnson out for the extra point, and he gets it. BYU 34, Florida State 10.
BYU is looking to be taking on Notre Dame in round two. They keep this up. Florida State just does not have an answer as they begin in zone two. With four minutes left in the third quarter, they're going to go run against a safe. 62, at least one defensive back rated runs, run zero. And that is a no. Solid tackling. That happened on third down. Florida State going to have to punt again because they cannot get things going. That's an O, a 1. And they're only going to go punt one zone on the great return by BYU once again deep in Florida State territory. And they, they ought to just go ahead and call off the dogs. The 84 BYU Cougars are going to call out the second string against Florida State here in the second half. They're going to go run against a run. So one positive thing Florida State's got going for them today. Let's see if they can actually stop them here. 63. And that's a fumble. So Florida State with a turnover on their own as we have one minute left in the third quarter. And they're going to go pass sequence for the last minute of the third. That's going to be against a blitz. 52. Two or more players on defensive line rated zero pass. That is a no. That is a sack. So Florida State sacked once more. We go to the fourth quarter. BYU up 34-10. to 10. And Florida State will be punting here at the start of the fourth quarter. BYU well in control as they hit a four. One, two, three, four. Good punt there by Florida State doesn't really matter BYU seemingly running at will or moving at will they're going to go ahead and go run against a blitz 56 at least one defensive lineman rated run zero and that is a no so that is a gain actually if there was one zero that would be an XR but it's just a regular gain that's going to be a gain of two zones BYU marching once again. They'll go pass against the safe. 35, two or more wide receivers rated two pass. And that's going to be David Millis and Glenn Kozlowski. So, yes, that is completion. We're going to have a review after this. So, a completion of two. And an offense, uh, the receiver caught the pass to the sideline. It was ruled complete, but the replay official checks the video to determine whether the receiver had both feet in bounds. And after further review, we have a reversal. Pass is ruled incomplete. So we are uh, playing modern day rules here, I believe. I don't remember when video review was done back then, but we're playing modern day rules. That is going to, let's see here, that was a 35 ruled incomplete, and that will be the end of the drive for BYU. As they're going to go ahead and punt it here, they only have two zones. Florida State with their next possession in their third zone, they're going to go pass against the pass. Things are just not going Florida State's way here in this first game. 65, two or more linebackers rated zero pass. And that is a no. Is the passer's Y less than four? It is four, so that is a no. And that's going to be an interception. And that is one zone ahead. So BYU just piling it on. Florida State's passing game cannot do anything against them. I think there's been four sacks and two INTs. The interception will go to Mark Allen. So BYU just pushing their way, pushing Florida State around as they're going to go run against a safe. Thirteen is a runner AA or better. I should have done this whether or not it's inside or outside call. Inside is dot outside, so it's inside. 
and we're going to look up the runner two. Uh, that will be inside will be Lakay Heimley. Is he an AA inside or better? Yes, he is, and that is going to be a gain. So gain on the play will be an XR go, and that's going to be a touchdown by Heimley. So BYU with let's see 61, barely got it. Seven more. BYU 41, Florida State 10. BYU to kick off. Florida State will start in zone two. It doesn't really matter though. Florida State's not moving the ball anyway. And they're going to go run since they have no pass game. That's going to be against a blitz. 66, two or more defensive backs rated run zero. And that is a no. I should just for the heck of it throw in the backups. but uh, Two or more defensive backs rated run zero. No. DB rushes in, stops the runner. And Florida State. Common theme, they are punting as they'll punt three zones. BYU to get the ball back just inside their own territory. They're going to go ahead and come out running against the Blitz themselves. 12 is a runner AAA or better. That'll be an outside. That'll be a 14 who is Sikahima. Vi Sikahima. Ooh, on an outside. Is runner AA or better? Sigahima is. Yes, he is. That is an XR. Four, uh, four zones. One, two, three, four. And even when BYU is just trying to run out the clock, Florida State still is not catching them. As they're going to go run against a goal line blitz. 25. Three or more players rated run two on the offense. I'm sure that it's got to be a yes. Lake Lakay Heimley, no. So that is just a couple yards. That'll end the drive. They'll go for a field goal. Lee Johnson is an AA in zone one. He's pretty much just a chip shot, and he's going to get it as BYU goes up three more. It is 44 to 10 as they get set to kick off to Florida State, who's pretty much ought to just catch the ball and give it to them as that is an O, as a <laughs> zone two fumble. Oh my goodness. Even when BYU is, they ought to just kneel the rest of this game. They got, they got to run one more play and then they can kneel. But they're going to go run against a blitz, so Florida State is still trying to blitz against them. 54, fumble, ooh, is it returnable? It may be, and I cannot remember how this is played out. Fumble, is it returnable? See advanced options. So let me look at the advanced options real quick and check that out. Okay. So I don't want to hose Florida State out of any points. So we're going to do, um, we're going to see if it was a, it was a fumble. So is it returnable? We're going to go. Dot, yes, blank, no, and no is not returnable. Florida State, two minutes left in the game. They take possession of the ball, looking to score about 34 points in two minutes. And they're going to, uh, they're just going to go ahead and run. They're going to run this thing out. Run versus blitz, 43. Four more players rated run zero on the offense. So we'll see. It doesn't look like it. So that is a no. Ron Dugans is the only one. So that is a gain of XR. Four zones. One, two, three, four. They're going to play for pride here. They're going to go ahead and run again against a blitz. 45, defensive penalty sustains the drive for one zone. So BYU's staff members in the front office letting Florida State run on them now. They're going to go, if, if they go run again, then next play, BYU automatically chooses uh, 
whatever they call. That's going to be a safe. May not matter at this point, though. 51. Two or more defensive backs rated run. Two. Mark. Uh, no. That is going to be another gain. <laughs> Zone of one. 30 seconds left. Florida State's going to go for it. They're going to go run. And BYU is automatically going to call run. Since we called three runs in a row, Florida State just trying to kill the clock and ended up being successful. 12 is runner AAA or better. That's going to be inside Travis Miner. No, he is not. That is no gain as they get stuffed. And that is the ball game. BYU 44, Florida State 10. <laughs> a little bit of a lopsided gain there. If I remember right, this is, I was about, would have been about 12, uh, 14 years old when I first started getting kind of into college football. And I remember watching Florida State back then, and they didn't really, they didn't do much for me. So maybe that was a, I can't remember if that was a weak year for college football or what, but man, I guess 84 was a good year, especially for BYU. But anyway, folks, BYU moves on. They will face Notre Dame in the second round next up will be 1986 Penn State Nittany Lions and the 1995 Nebraska Cornhuskers. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd appreciate a like. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any upcoming action. But until next time, guys, thank you very much for watching. Have a great night.